Hi, my name is Alex and I'm 10 years old. How many different types of cancer are there? My name is Mark Garnick and I am a physician at the Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center and actually a cancer specialist and a faculty member at the Harvard Medical School, both of which are located in Boston, Massachusetts. And the question is, how many different types of cancers are there? There are numerous different types of cancers. And each organ in the body, such as the lung or the breast or the prostate gland or the thyroid gland or the large intestine or the adrenal gland or the kidney, all can lead to abnormal cells which can actually be diagnosed as cancer. So each organ can have its own type of cancer. In general, there are three major types of cancers. There are so-called the common epithelial cancers, which include cancers of the breast, lung, colon, and prostate. There can be cancers of soft tissues, which are known as sarcomas. There can be cancers of the bone, which are known as osteogenic sarcomas, or there can be cancers of the blood-forming organs or the lymph nodes, which are, caused, which are called either leukemia, in the case of cancers of the blood-forming cells, or lymphoma, which is cancer of the lymph nodes. So in general, there are many different types of individual cancers that can develop from these organs Although there's not a specific number of different types of cancers, we can categorize cancers according to epithelial cancers, such as breast, colon, lung, prostate, or liver, sarcomas, which are cancers of connective tissue or bone, and leukemias and lymphomas, which are cancers of the blood-forming organs or the lymph nodes. They can also be cancers of the skin. Perhaps the most common type of cancer is actually skin cancer. And skin cancer really comes in three major forms, so-called squamous carcinoma or basal cell carcinoma or the much more aggressive type of skin cancer known as melanoma. Within each form of cancer, there are many different types of cancers that a pathologist who is a, who is a physician that specializes in looking at cells under the microscope can actually diagnose. So for example, you know, a cancer that I deal with on a day-to-day -day basis, prostate cancer, there's really one major type of prostate cancer called adenocarcinoma. There are also lesser frequent forms of cancer called small cell cancer. In the case of lung cancer, there are really four major forms of cancer in the lung, so-called adenocarcinoma, squamous carcinoma, large cell carcinoma, or something that's called small cell carcinoma. Those are the major forms of cancer. Within breast cancer, the most common form is called an infiltrating ductal adenocarcinoma. Within the liver, the most common form is called hepatocellular carcinoma. Within the pancreas, the most common form is called pancreatic adenocarcinoma. So each organ can have its own form of cancer and as I mentioned, in some of the organs, there can be many, many different types of actual cancers that can develop in that organ.